The former first grade teacher finds himself in front of the courtroom again. Prosecutors hope he never steps foot in a classroom again. He's a dangerous individual. Mr. Sedlicek, you're charged with four counts of sexual assault on a child in the first degree. The state filed five more felonies against the 30-year-old. Those charges are on top of the two others stemming from an incident witnessed by other teachers and caught on surveillance video on the school playground at Fontenelle Elementary. It appears that it had been going on for a while and it was multiple occasions. Police say when they interviewed Sedlicek, he gave them a list of alleged victims. So did his seven-year-old student from the playground. She also disclosed that she had seen him touch several classmates. With the help of Project Harmony, child experts interviewed five more first graders, all six years old, who told similar stories. They say their teacher violated them by touching them inappropriately in their classroom in front of each other, quote, lots of times. What's important is the fact that people know that somebody's reported that and that gives them the courage, I think, to come forward, strengthen numbers. You know, I feel like I can come forward if there's somebody else already doing it. Beadle says the details are so disturbing, people naturally tend to believe things like this don't happen. But she says in Sedlicek's classroom, he sexually assaulted his students. Hopefully that, um, you know, they can they can forget about it after this is over and they're at such a young age that we hope that they can do that and they're not traumatized so for a long period of time by that. Michelle Bandewer, KETV, Newswatch 7. Each of the first degree sexual assault charges carries 20 years to life in prison. Sedlicek is expected back in court the day after Christmas. <laughs>